European um, Yacht Club looking at our first boat. And it's, um, we're not going to take it out on the water because the water's all frozen. <laughs> So we just saw a 31 Hunter. Yep, from 2006. Yeah, it's got lots of usable space. It's got headroom. It looks very efficient. They said that one person can sail it. We liked it. <laughs> we liked it. <laughs> <laughs> We got a lot of negative but meaningly helpful advice. We understand that we look young and maybe are not super prepared, but we are doing this anyways. We are in it for the adventure, not for a cruise. Yeah, th these are our mistakes to make and we'll make them wholeheartedly. <laughs> We are at the Port Credit Harbor Marina. We're gonna look at a 33 foot hunter. We're excited! Also, on another note, it seems like there's an early spring that's come. There are puddles everywhere and lots of water running off the boats. They look like they just come out of the water. We just saw the 33 hunter and we love it! We're getting a little bit too excited. We're trying to control ourselves. We both really love the super smart design. It feels really big, lots of storage. Looks like it would be easy to sail for a dummy like me. It's just beautiful inside. We just went this on reflection. Really nice guy. He really loves his boat and he spent a lot of time on it. Yeah, um, clearly he's a handyman. He kept talking to me instead of Diana though, which is pretty funny because Diana's a, <laughs> she's a lot more of a handyman than I am. So there was a lot of usable space and I'm actually surprised that they could fit two heads in there and it was like quite an interesting layout. But from a home ownership perspective, the more people like play around with their boats, the more the next owner has to deal with it. So I don't think it's such a good idea. Looking on large for sale.com. There's a boat right now for 79,000 US in Massachusetts. Um, the site is awesome for finding things, but terrible for documenting them because it doesn't have its own special URL. So we just have to keep looking at it each time. But whatever, it's all good. Maybe we'll go check her out. So we are in uh, White River Junction. Junction. Oh, this is our morning to look at a boat in Marston Mills, Massachusetts. We arrived ridiculously late uh, driving from Ottawa last night. Uh, it took about six, six and a bit hours because of uh, some bad weather. But we're here now. We're excited. Oh. And it's just so people know, it's the end of March. So we're not amused by this bad weather. We've arrived at our first boat in Massachusetts. We can't see it, it's under, it's under a big cover. Yeah, but it's in this cool place that's called Sandwich. And so there's East Sandwich and South Sandwich. And now we're hungry. <laughs> and there doesn't seem to be any sandwiches around. We're going this way. And check it out. Okay, we just got off the boat. Yep. Um, Our first catamaran view. Yeah. It was, yeah. Okay, what do you think of the boat? Should we say on three? We'll go like three, two, one, and then we'll say what we thought. Okay, like as in good or? Yeah. Okay. I just don't, I don't want to alter your opinion. Uh, okay. 
Okay, so three, two, one. Like I it. liked it. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> Neither of us said good. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, we both said we liked it. Cool. Well, that's good news then. <laughs> We're both on the same page and that's, uh, that's going to be helpful. Yeah, it's a little bit on the old side, so we still have some questions, or at least I have some questions. Uh, but we'll go from there. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm hopeful. Bye.